or you. The finale is finally here. Press F in the chat for my awful upload schedule. Do it now. Uh, uh, my Brussels sprouts. Leave me alone, ghost detective. <laughs> Ouch! Oof. Even through death, your memories still find a way to torment me. No matter, detective. That stubbornness can only last for so long. I myself realized that trying to save even my wife became hopeless. It's a shame, really. She just didn't appreciate my dream of becoming a world-famous beatboxer even after the potion. So come at me, detective. Try and stop me from making a worldwide fan. Fan base. <laughs> I may hate my life, but there's no way I'm letting some moldy old potato take it from me. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you'd say that. Say what? And you're a massive roach? Oh, the pain. Always with the insults. Mr. P, are you okay? I'm here to help you. Oh my, what a sweet young fan. Would you like some free beatboxing? Please, Mr. P, you're my hero who I watched on TV every day. Snap out of it. You're terrible at beatboxing. Wow, nice one, Georgie. Real subtle. <laughs> Ah, oh, I see. You're here to hurt me too. No, wait. I didn't mean... I don't care anymore. You hurt my feelings. Piracy, not budgie. If they won't appreciate my dreams, then we'll have to force them to take care of them. Uh. Uh. Hey, you. Get back here and listen to my beatboxing. Uh. What? What are you gonna do? Uh. <sighs> On second thought, listen, not budgie was it? I'm constantly sleep deprived and there's this thing I've been doing which raises my heart rate to an alarming amount of beats per minute so my muscles and agility output levels can keep up with your enhanced infected bodies. But in the process it completely damages my blood vessels and heart. So if we could just not fight or if you could just leave and live a happy life anywhere but here, that would be great. <laughs> I hate these freaks. You should have run when you had the chance. Yoink. Stay away from me, you monster! Leave me alone! Huh? Hey, Mr. Prick! Beatboxing sucks! Oh, I'm offended! How could you? Huh? <laughs> Was that really dynamite? It's so bright! Come on, where are you, you roach? <laughs> there. <laughs> it's over, Mr. P. You're finished. I won't give you the satisfaction of dying here, though. <laughs> I'm afraid you're wrong, detective. <laughs> I've already won. <laughs> to pay for your crimes, for being the root cause of death for so many people, you're gonna come with me and be left to rot in a prison <laughs> Do you understand now, detective? No one's getting in the way of my dreams. <sighs> Veggie, be my fan. There's one more scoundrel I'm gonna need you to take care of. Oh, my life sucked anyway. Might as well watch these final moments in peace. Uh, but please help! Mr. P is a meanie! Pony! Zizzy! Someone! Anyone! Help! So much for a peaceful ending. This sucks. <laughs> <laughs> You've decided that after all of that, it's time to just give up? 
What happened to beating some sense into him, huh? Didn't I tell you that I believe in you? That you'll do great? I know you're in pain, and you've already been through a lot. You powered through and come this far as determined as it can be, right? What changed? Where's the protagonist everyone knows and loves, huh? Don't leave that poor, vulnerable little roach to die alone. You may hate it on the outside, but I know, deep down, roaches like this is why you became a detective in the first place. <laughs> <sighs> now hold on there, Badgie. Maybe I could use his pitiful screams for inspiration. Wait, detective, please. I know what you're capable of. He's not my hero, not anymore. Oh, I can picture it now. The story of Mr. P, an astonishing beatboxing prodigy from Zero because to Hero. Because of this, I see the true evilness of Mr. P now, which is why you're my hero. Sigh. It's a shame my talents aren't recognized in today's you. So please, be my hero, Detective Fudson! Uh, Georgie, you dang fat piece of bacon. Look at you, coming all this way, playing the coward until the very end. Not even a shred of confidence in you. Scared of what became of your own family, you ran. Ran until someone finally remembered what they were even looking for in the first place. Only to continue being a baby pisspants roach by hiding inside the mall waiting for someone to come to the rescue. So what were you thinking? Suddenly attempting to play my role as the protagonist when it's most convenient for you? Now look at you. Too afraid to even run away anymore. You really are the worst. Which is why it's my duty to protect or I even kill you myself! Oh my! Detective Fudson! Badgie, it looks like my beatboxing story has inspiration for an antagonist final battle. Let's get him! Even in my near-death hallucination, I'll always consider you to be best, girl bunny. Hey! Behind you! Stop messing around, detective! You're, You're gonna, gonna ruin, ruin my, my epic, epic beatboxing movie inspiration! inspiration. Mm. What? What is it? You go, detective! Just as epic as the old days, hmm? I'm not sure where you got all these cool moves from, but <laughs> as your captain, I am proud of you regardless! What? <laughs> Don't give up now, Detective Fudson! I know, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm? 
What's wrong, Mr. Detective? Ready to give up like that pathetic little bunny friend of yours? <gasps> How dare he call me pathetic? And I am not a bunny! Where are you, bunny? If your arm is still... infected, <laughs> Hey, big guy! Your potions keep doing the wrong things! I mean, look at you! You freak! <laughs> Mr. P, why do you look so sad? Everyone has dreams, but bringing yours to reality and taking them too far to this? Oh, yeah, I get it now. Your wife. Driven by determination on top of depression, you sacrificed your own sanity for her. Was the beatbox in a mask to hide and distract yourself from all of that? I neglected those I was supposed to protect, senselessly expressed my frustrations and anger out on whoever I felt, leading to a kid who doesn't know any better. Poor conflicted little bacon. The worst? And that's me without a doubt. Ah. <sighs> Still, it's something I can't let you take away from me here. Not now. You understand that. I have to make things right. I lost who I was. Same as you. A good detective of the law, but against you. A potato driven to crime and insanity by his own desires. Unable to achieve them, I'm sure the state you're in now eventually became a cry for help to end all of your suffering. Mm, Mr. P, thank you for helping me realize that. I'll use everything I have left to make this quick. Farewell, friend. Get off my screen, you ugly little roach. <sighs> Come on. We're done here. Wow, you look like crap. Hey, what's he doing? Detective, shush. You've suffered enough already. Huh? What? <laughs> We make a good team, Sissy. How about a celebratory kiss? I value our friendship too. What? Hey, you two. Looks like we all won. Yeah, I suppose. That's awesome! I'm proud of you, Fudzy. Oi, Detective. What now? Even with Mr. P gone, the world is still full of infected. That can be your next objective! Shut up, Georgie! <laughs> Come on, our adventures can wait. Let's all head home. Yeah, home sounds great.